Hi. Did Hillary's emails on her private server lead to the execution of Sharaham Amiri, uh, an American spy who was killed by the Iranians, hanged by him this past Sunday? There's a lot of evidence to suggest that they did. Uh, Hillary Amiri uh, was trying to confuse the Iranians and said that he had been kidnapped by the United States and by Saudi Arabia and forced to come to America. Uh, and uh, that story was his cover story. Uh, he was an expert on radiation and radioactive isotopes, and he was working on the Iranian atomic bomb, and he had inside information about how the research was coming and what was going on. Uh, he, but he tried to dress this up, not as his going to the United States to give them information, but the Americans kidnapping him. Well, first Hillary Clinton said in one of her emails, Mr. Amiri has been in the United States of his own free will. He's free to go. He was free to come. These decisions are his alone to make, clearly contradicting his narrative that he was here involuntarily. And then in one of the emails, one of Hillary's deputies said, quote, Our friend has to be given a way out. He should recognize, we should recognize his concerns and frame it in terms of a misunderstanding with no malevolent intent and that it will make sure there's no recurrence. Our person won't be able to do anything anyway. If he has to leave, so be it. So that's clearly a statement by uh, Hillary's people in an email uh, that he was a spy. Uh, and that we have to frame the way he was presented uh, in terms of his arrival in the United States in a way that would help him and there would be no misunderstanding. Well, when these two emails hit Tehran, they obviously drew the correct conclusion that this guy was a spy. Uh, he had returned to Iran, presumably to continue spying, nominally to visit his five-year-old son, and was celebrated as a national hero when he returned, because his narrative was that the USA had kidnapped him, and now he was coming back to Iran. But when it turned out that that was false, that in fact he was a spy uh, trying to help the United States, uh, as soon as they, her emails came out, they busted him, arrested him, and on Sunday executed him. So, Hillary... Your use of a private email server, unprotected, which could be hacked by anybody, has now led to the execution of a patriotic, patriotic American uh, who is trying to spy for the United States against Iran, his native country. I hope you're satisfied with yourself. Uh, if you uh, please spread this around, we, this needs to become a big scandal that affects her, re -elect, her election chances. Uh, this is the first concrete illustration of malfeasance in connection with her private email server, but it's so complicated that a lot of people don't get it, so I wanted to explain it as clearly as I could. And if you read our book Armageddon, How Trump Can Beat Hillary, you can see how this fits into the whole game plan of making terrorism, Iran, and our whole relationship with that country and the phony nuclear deal central issues of the campaign. So please pick up a copy of Armageddon, How Trump Can Beat Hillary, and come to my website. If you enter your e-address, uh, I'll, I'll send you all my videos every day, and you can keep track of this stuff. And I hope you mark me down as a like. I like you, and uh, it'll help us stay in touch. Thank you very much for listening.